today we've all come together to think about the way we want to achieve the vision of Pillar 6 of our National Digital Health Strategy, which is having a workforce who are confidently using digital technologies to deliver better health and care and making sure they've all got access to resources that teach them how to do that. It's been an area that we have been talking about for really quite some time, but we haven't necessarily had that sort of mobilisation around it. Taking a really clear long-term view about how health systems need to better support our workforce adoption of digital technologies is a paramount consideration for all of our health systems nationally. You know looking at from community consumer perspectives as well as from health professional perspectives and provider perspectives those sort of things are really good for everybody to be kind of across. Nursing is the biggest health workforce, the most distributed health workforce in Australia. So it's important for me that nurses are fully engaged in digital health and its rollout and input into the redesign. The digital health workforce of Australia needs to be much larger than it is at the moment. So this is about how we can develop those skills in the current workforce. We're seeing the only way to do that is to augment the workforce to improve how they deliver care so they can continue to deliver good care by using technology. Although we've been getting focused on technology, we've been getting the technology right, we've now got to do the adaptive side of things so that people have got the skills they need to use that technology effectively. So how do you change the way you practiced using technology to support that? So I think it's really important that uh, health professionals have those skills to be able to operate in a new environment with new models of care that are very patient-centred. Health services need to support that by providing learning environments where people can grow and change and adapt their work practices. The tools that we design need to be intuitive. They need to be uh, not disruptive or interruptive to uh, clinician workflows. People need to feel comfortable recording that data. They need to be comfortable accessing digital data. It's what delivers good care to patients. We need to ensure that patients are the centre of whatever focus of activity we have and in that process solutions facilitate our care rather than get in the way. And you can only do that with data and you can only do that by supporting the clinicians get the right data in but also people skilled enough to know how to read insights out of that data and manage communities and the individual patient. To ensure they spend maximum time with their patients and less time with the administration and the architecture of those healthcare solutions. I think it's really important through the Australian Digital Health Agency that we have a roadmap that actually helps us decide how we do this better across the country. And get to the point where we've got that workforce who are confidently using digital health technologies to deliver safer health and care.